Hello everybody, this is Kathy Grosskirth with Bookkeeping Clean and Simple and this is a short tutorial to explain to you why I prefer to use the Incognito browser with Chrome to access QuickBooks Online Accountant and QuickBooks Online Client files. You'll see in a minute why this is advantageous and this is one of the things that Intuit recommends also. Say, for instance, most people that I know will start using the with the Chrome browser, just the standard browser, and some of the things that they experience hiccups with are being able to click on hot links that don't work. Or they might try to access a register and get the blue circle of death as we all have seen. Anything like that, any hiccups in bank feeds or anything like that, 80 to 90 percent of the problems are due to in the most cases using the standard google chrome browser even though google chrome is the recommended browser it is recommended that even if you're an accountant user or even as a client accessing quickbooks online it is suggested that you use the incognito browser which we will do right here if you go to the top right of your screen, just underneath the X, you'll see a three ellipse button. You're going to click on that. Scroll down to where it says New Incognito Window. Once you see that, you're going to open it up and you'll see it looks a lot different than the regular window. First of all, you'll see the little spy character in the upper right corner which is I mean in the upper left corner which is kind of cute but then it tells you a little bit about what going incognito means it means it won't save your browsing history or cookies and site data which tends to interfere with some of the functions of QBO which is one of the reasons why we recommend you use it so once you get there then you can log into your QuickBooks online account just as you would normally do so for most of you that are experiencing any type of problems, if you're using a standard browser, either Chrome or whatever, try the incognito mode and especially use the Chrome browser in the incognito setting. And most of the time you will alleviate probably about 80 to 90 percent of the problems that you are experiencing working within QBO or QBOA. And so that's all I have for now. As many of you know, I do all sorts of training and consulting in QuickBooks desktop and online. I would love to speak to you. You can go to my website on my contacts page and set up a one hour free initial consult with me. And I would love to talk to you. So take care everybody and have a wonderful day.